friends! It's Morale. Today we're going on an exciting adventure to learn about something super cool. The solar eclipse. Are you ready to start our adventure? A solar eclipse happens when the moon moves between Earth and the sun. Imagine a cosmic game of hide and seek, where the moon sneaks up and covers the sun, casting a shadow on Earth. And voila! The moon gradually blocks out the light from the sun. When the sun and moon line up perfectly, we call it a total solar eclipse. It's like a magical show in the sky. The moon covers the sun completely, turning day into night. The sky becomes darker, just like night. You can even see the stars. Seeing a total solar eclipse is super rare. It's like finding a four-leaf clover in a field of green. They don't happen very often because the sun, moon, and earth need to align perfectly. Most people only see one in their whole life. We're really lucky to see them at all. The moon is 400 times smaller than the sun, but it's also 400 times closer to Earth. Isn't that a fun coincidence? This perfect balance makes them appear the same size to us. So, when the moon blocks the sun, we see a hole in the sky. Never look directly at the sun, it can hurt your eyes. When a solar eclipse happens, it's important to be safe. Just like you'd use a hat or an umbrella to shield yourself from the sun, the moon does the same for us during an eclipse. Just like using your hand to block sunlight, the moon blocks the sun's light for us. But don't worry, you can still watch the eclipse safely. There are several ways to do this. You could use a pinhole viewer, a simple device that projects the image of the sun, or you could wear special eclipse glasses that protect your eyes. If neither of those are available, try using a colander from the kitchen. Ask your parents to help you make a pinhole viewer or find special eclipse glasses. You can even use a colander. I hope you had fun learning about solar eclipses with me. Don't forget, new adventures await. Remember to subscribe to Learn with Morale. See you next time.